trying to preach him, looking at the children. So many things were the most important. They were all the most important. Don't get it wrong. This is not some fanatic kind of, you know, propaganda pitch. But for the sake of all of the services, she was about that made it clear that the dissemination of his literature was the most quantitatively speaking particularly, the most uh, profound, the most um, emphasized uh, activity as far as outreach goes. Uh, sadhana, relations, everything is, is important. So everything is essential to support that. Like in a war, everything is important behind the scenes. You can't just go on the battlefield with no guns, with no bullets, with no food, with no clothes. You won't get very much support. Everything's important. But the, this made Popham very enlightened because he knew that these books, he said, even if we all leave this world, this movement will carry on because the books, even if we all leave, give up our practice, the books are there. It's the seeds of the roots. This is a famous turning point, you could say, in the Lord Chaitanya Sankirtan movement. This is a painting of Shiro Prabhupada on the right, Arab Prabhupada, with his son, uh, with his Gurudev, Bhakti Siddhartha Saraswati Maharaj, in uh, Bhakti Siddhartha Maharaj's residence at Radhakund. I have a desire to print some books, Bhakti Siddhartha Maharaj said. If ever you get money, he's saying this to our Shiro if ever you get money, print books. It will be better to take the marble from the walls and secure money. He's referring to the big temple in Calcutta, which they recently constructed in 1934. Um, he said, it would be better to take the marble from the walls and secure money. If I could do this and print books, that would be better. Not that he wanted to do that, but he saw this mentality of living comfortably with coming in, that this is my temple, my room, my this, my that, and that was Bhakti Siddhanta, practically speaking, left the world because of this, my mentality, possessive mentality, um, which case coming amongst some of his disciples is dangerous, thinking, I have, this is my privilege, this is my room, this is my temple, this is my property, etc. This is the basic disease of illusion which we're all in while we're stuck in this world. So Prabhupada's movement is to remove that disease condition of life. Um, but here we see that he's saying that the disease is still there and it's coming up again. Better we print books. And Prabhupada took that as his, practically speaking, his life and soul. He didn't so much have a problem with that day should place, but he had a service wherever he went, which is books. Wherever he went, he would be translating, commenting on the scriptures, and encouraging the devotees to distribute them, print them, publish, etc. Wherever he went, in different languages, very much so here in France. He was very, very pleased with, for instance, at that time, the old GBC here, Bhagavan Prabhu very pleased with his service in that regard. It cannot be taken away. The uh, service of the devotees at that time, inspired by Lord GBC at that time. And all over the world the same thing. And in England, our GBC, in England in the 70s, would be sitting down with us, packing the books, taking the devotees on Sankirtan. He would be actively involved in the Mass. He wouldn't just be looking at the scores at the end, but he would be actually involved according to their capacity. Not to speak of Ramashwar and others um, who would be right in the middle of it all. Um, why? Because Prabhupada said, the BBT is my heart. This is the very heart of Shri Prabhupada. It's the pulse, the tick of this gone. Many times Prabhupada would me measure a success by how many books were distributed. Even preaching programs. In London, I only came back from a preaching program. The first thing probably said, How many books were distributed? He didn't ask how many 
people. You can ask what it is like. You just want to know how many see the judge many times not as successful if they're taking the books. So it's a big thing, and it is a big thing, and we may not see it Why? Some people think book distribution has been near place. I heard this two days ago from a sannyasi, not in his time. This is a neophyte activity, it's not pure devotion. So. Quite something, huh? It's mixed with, you know, other things. Well, if we look at the Gaudiya Math logo, Bhakti Siddhanta Maharaj, you'll see he's, um, he's doing two sides. One is Raghunuga Bhakti, one is Pancharaka. Which is spontaneous, pure devotional service. And he's put various symbols on there, you know, offering RT in the books and different things. And on the Raganuga side, which is what we're trying to aspire for, is the printing press. The printing Hello. press. The printing press. He considered this as the path of Raganuga Bhakti. Not a mundane act. He had the printing press in the temple room. The gate is one end, the press at the other. And it's churning out the books as the same, the days things are going on there and the printing is going in the same room. Same room. To him, the printing press, although it's a mundane thing, but when used to print books about the absolute, it becomes like a spiritual. It's like a day. It's not a, a light thing. Very, you know, we have forms, technologically speaking, developed systems of this, but the principle is still the same. The importance, I remember when we were trying to get the Isu Upanishad printed in Swahili in Nairobi, and we were, uh, the, the, the um, printer, the, the Scottish man, he was the managing the printing press there in Nairobi. He was telling me, uh, Communism, of course, this is back in the 70s. Um, communism was spreading in India huh? and in other parts of the world quite strongly. And he, he was a, a great, he was very happy with us because we wanted to print books. And he was always encouraging us to print more books. And he wasn't loaded, he was just a Scotsman managing the printing press. He said, said that, you know, he quoted, he would like to quote Karl Marx. You know, Karl Marx was philosophically founder of communism, I guess, philosophically. Um, and uh, Karl Marx had made the statement, I will conquer the world with 26 metal soldiers. Mm -hmm. And of course we may not understand what that refers to. We don't see it now, but in those days it, it was a letter press. Now we have everything's, you know, what they call it, the computer But it was a letter press in those days. You had to make the, you had to make all the words with little metal, with tiny letters, and you had to put it in boxes, and then it would onto the ink and onto the paper like this, boom, 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 boom. A real mechanical process. Had people sitting there and make, you know, putting all these little letters together to you know, make up a sentence and so on. Letter press, twenty-six letters. He said, with these iron soldiers, these twenty-six iron. You know, letters that will conquer the world. And that's basically how communism spread in, in, in China and in, 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 in India and other parts of the world was through prop propagation, literature propagation, very powerful. And now Krishna consciousness movement is spread primarily, most mostly through the distribution of books. Most people's first serious contact is through books. So Prabhupada took that as his life and soul um, and gave his very life for the publication of books. Welcome! Ooh. Well, look at them. They, they both got initiated today, huh? Yes. Uh, is that, isn't that auspicious? Oh, are they here? Where's Saranya? She will be here shortly. She'll be here shortly. She'll be here shortly. Well, she was there then. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the Srila Prabhupada Book Marathon 2023. That's a mistake. Well, maybe they're just giving you a... Uh, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 
and they've forgotten what the time is. That's another aspect of a marathon. You forget what the day is, you forget what the time is, you forget what the year is, you even forget where you are. <laughs> Many times I forget where I am. <laughs> where are we? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we're now starting the 2024 marathon. Yes, only 2024 is a fact. Huh? Same place, Maraj. Same place. Why is it? I mentioned earlier, I don't know if it was in public, but we're just thinking about this place. This, you may recognize this place. Does anyone know where that is? <laughs> Pardon? The L. 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 More than 20 years every year on Rathiatra, even Lord Juggernaut went there <laughs> on Rathiatra. It must be a special place, huh? <laughs> How many times has there been a Harinam? Where is, where is he gone with Rohini? How many times have you done Harinam in Shakulay Leal? At least thousands, I think. Thousands in the last five to ten years. Thousands of times. Yeah, before that. Before, 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 before. Uh, before that also. We have two places, Saint Michel and Chatelet. It's still the same. <laughs> More or less. We go sometimes to the places, but they, there's something magnetic about this place. Hell is that it is. It's kind of like all hell let loose. It's like all hell, everything's there, isn't it? All kinds of crazy people and <laughs> crazy things going on. And it's like a madhouse. <laughs> But it's like a magnetic madhouse. You had a rest one five minutes from there. Huh? You had a rest one less than five minutes from there. Marbrus. Uh, millions, I don't know millions, but hundreds of thousands of Bhagavad Gita's have been distributed there. Tens of thousands of devotees have spent hundreds of thousands of hours there. <laughs> Not millions of hours. <laughs> what a place. It is something special about it. We <laughs> also have a Burger King. Yeah. We also have Burger King and McDonald's. And Burger King. Now there's a new store, a wonderful store. It's a, a donut <laughs> store. <laughs> the famous donut store, which was really they even we someone even donated this box of donuts. <laughs> <laughs> I had to, that was the toughest day of the marathon for me, controlling my senses with a box of donuts <laughs> all day long. Convincing myself they do have eggs and they do have eggs and you can't eat them. They have eggs and they have eggs and don't eat them, don't eat them. <laughs> yeah, fresh donuts. Great for them. Hot, fresh donuts. <laughs> and every day outside of that donut shop, almost every day in the same spot. <laughs> I was just sat there almost every day outside the donut shop. People were queuing up by the hundreds of donuts. No one was queuing up for books, but they queued up for donuts. <laughs> Maybe we should have donuts on our bookstore next next year. We give a free book with a donut. <laughs> we do some some trade with the shop, you know. We make some arrangements. Uh. Every donut, they give a free gita. <laughs> See Krishna plan. So thank you all. And a big part of this year's marathon was a daily distribution of cookies. I don't know how many cookies they produced. Indu Lake and her team, the Nandini. And uh, here we see the, the young Vaishnavis. They're not in the room today, but there they are helping put the jam uh, in the cookies. I think they're putting jam, yeah, inserting the jam. It was a big, big part of it. Every day we were just doing boxes of cookies. Every day almost. We had thousands of cookies. It really went down well, wasn't it? I think the devotees liked the cookies very much. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, the public liked the cookies very much. <laughs> anyway, a few for the public. Mostly for the public. Very nice. So let me thank Andy.
Dream, Andrew Ali, and your lake, and all the team for preparing so many boxes of cookies to distribute on the street, and lots of other things too to keep the army going. Arrivo! Not sure. We had uh, four big boxes, so I don't know how many cookies that is. But we still have some in the temple if you want. Yes, one, small <laughs> box, one small box left, only a tiny box. Yeah. And if you want to, you can go to Paris and get a cookie. So we're going to start now with the scores. Ooh. And we have speed it up a little bit, of course, and there's a lot of those. With this, one thing to note here, 148 names. Arrivo! And Arrivo! We, start, we all start at the top. So number one in this year's marathon, Vishnu Jananandan. <laughs> Arrivo! Jai! Arrivo! You're not here. One book. <laughs> we should be literature. One piece of literature. Wonderful. Determined every year, he makes sure he does one book, one piece of literature. <laughs> and equal, equal top. Bhakti Sarpabhu. Are you here? Yes. Yes, there he is. Bhakti Sarpabhu came all the way to India to join us for the marathon. <laughs> oh, they get presents. Look at that, my goodness me. Can you catch? <laughs> I'm not good at throwing from an angle. Oh, I, I might get oh, the I don't want to hit the I don't mind throwing there, but you it. No, I can't do it like this and make it. Surprises coming up here. This one, I can pronounce it. Zoe or Zoe? Zoe. 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 You probably never heard of her. Never heard of her. Well, Jeeva Pran, tell the story. Um, so Zoe is actually um, one of three friends, <coughs> uh, three girls who met Revati Nandana back then, one year ago probably. And when they saw us in the in Chatelet. They were just remind, remembering about Revati Nandana, how it was a very nice exchange they had back then. They take back then Goût Supérieur, you know, the cooking book. And uh, so they were thinking, but what can we do now? Where is Revati Nandana? We said, sorry, but he's in India. In India? What is he doing there? <laughs> Which we were all wondering. Um, but <laughs> then they were trying to think, uh, how can we help you? Can we do something for you? You were so kind back then. They, then we proposed them to distribute books, and they said, okay, let's go, let's try. <laughs> there they went, they all did one book each, three and of them. Try. And they got donations for them. And they yeah. got donations, it's a fact. Yeah. Just see, anyone can do it. <laughs> Zoe and Emma's, Emma 1 and Emma 2 can do it. Yeah. <laughs> anyone can, huh? Why not? So inspiring, and so purifying, and so pleasing. So we like to thank, we don't know what, where they are, who they are, where they're from, what happened to them. <laughs> Some other Krishna guided them to Shatele Leal, <laughs> and uh, they distributed one book each. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. And Jeeva uh, Pran plugged them in to distribute the books. So they started their further steps in devotional service. When somebody distributes a book, you can imagine how much Lord Chaitanya and Nichi Lord Nichinanda are pleased. And then also with one book, um, I don't even know if they know they did it, but uh, Yadavir Prabhu and Susanna. Yeah. Where is Yadavir? Is he here? On the office, He's upstairs in the office. Susanna is here. Susanna is here? There we go. Where are you? There you go. Thank you very much. Hare Krishna. Arrivo. 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 This year you can double it at least, okay? <laughs> at least. <laughs> And here's another one, you've never heard of them either. Radha Rupa Rukmini Devi Dasi. Ever heard of them? Probably not, they're not from France. They were just passing through and uh, Nepali Tiger jumped on <laughs> and said, let's go for Sagatan. And she went out with 
and uh, you'll find out who that is later on in the Holy Saga. They went out together in <laughs> South Cell, just walked down the street into the town, and they both did a bunch of books, and rather it was just half an hour or so. On her way, she was about to catch a bus to the airport, but she spared 30 minutes for book distribution. Wow. So rather with, her, with me, David Darcy, from India, I think, with two books, Haribo! Haribo! Where does she live in India? Yeah. Oh, Portugal. That's right, she's from Portugal. Where, who's from Portugal here? It's right, do you know her? Rada Rupa Rukmi, she lives in Lisbon. Do you know her? She's one of the greatest preachers there. There you go, take this for her. Take, take this. Perfect job. How woke him up. Yeah, so say thanks to her when you get back there, okay? Make sure you don't eat that on the way, okay? It's not very secure. Oh, we have. Well, some scores from Portugal too, by the way, don't we? But that's not from here, that's from them. As they're, as they're in, the, in the light right now, I just read their score. We sent it to me. Where did you send it? You sent it today? Nitai Charan? Yesterday. Here it is. All glorious to Srila Prabhupada. Here is a report from the Lisbon Devotees book distribution for the December marathon. Without, that doesn't include Mahananda Prabhu, by the way. Between and Joel, if you don't know, put your hand up, Joel. Uh, your, and the okay. picture, and put your hand up. Is there anyone else in, included in this? The whole Yatra. The whole Yatra. The whole of Portugal. Distributed. 566 small books. Wow. Wow. 36 medium books. Wow. 583 Maha big books. Wow. Wow. Portugal. Portugal is a bit more than last year. No, no, it's not. You did more small books last year. Whatever, it's wonderful to see books going out again in Portugal. In Portugal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, do here. Yeah, here. Yeah, is here. There you go. Special <laughs> reward for coming out on the marathon. Thank <laughs> <Dang>, remember? <laughs> he gave a book out. He probably doesn't even remember. <laughs> He gave it to us. Oh. <laughs> anyway, you distribute it. That's the, that's the spirit. You distribute it. It's fantastic. Doesn't matter. Everyone's your brother. <laughs> and then, uh, oh, oh, well, this is a far, uh, this is a far distant book distribution going on here. Does anyone know who this is? Number one forty. Who knows who this person is? Shibadu Sundari Devi Dasi. It's the mother of Rohini Nanda. The mother of Rohini Nanda Prabhu. Haribo! Wife of Rambadra Prabhu. Haribo! Wonderful Vaishnavi. She took six books to distribute in India huh? or on the plane. On the plane. On the train. On the train or in the plane or in the drain or in Spain or in the crane or in the train. Or in Spain or in the drain or in the lane or in the pain. Or gain or loss or gain. You can distribute books anywhere, <laughs> even if you are insane. <laughs> and then we have, and this is would have been a, a different position, but very busy this year, unable to join us last year. On the far right, you see a little column there which says, I've only done it for a few. Last year's book's point score. Last year she was in the top 15, I think. Um, she distributed 108 Gitas on one day last year. On the day of the World Cup final when Argentina beat France. <laughs> <laughs> the French were depressed, but the Argentinians were in ecstasy. And she, being Argentinian herself, went to the Argentinian <laughs> embassy. She was, they were, all the Argentinian people in France were invited to the embassy for, to watch the match. So she went there, and when they won, she started going around, victory souvenirs, victory souvenirs, <laughs> all donation, and she just did about 108 books in 14 minutes or something. They didn't know what they were doing, they were just grabbing the book and giving her money. Right? <laughs> <laughs> she had Spanish, English, and French speakers. 
This year she only came out for a few minutes and uh, she listened to the big one book. Jai Haribo! Haribo! And then I guess you renew my applause, Sumitra Devi Dasi. Wow, wonderful. Who knows who Sumitra is? Not Devi Dasi. Is she here? Who knows who Sumitra is? Sundar Gopal's wife. Maybe with his mum. Sundar Gopal was here just now. They're in the kitchen. They're in the kitchen, just see. Serving all the Sankatan devotees. What a wonderful service. Cooking for the Sankatan festival. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> and then, as I said, we're, we're, looking, we're yeah. hoping of big stories now for the next one. <laughs> <laughs> also with one Maha big book. Not an ordinary one, a Maha big book. Rohini Nanda Prabhu. Oh. Hey, oh. Oh. have a story from my... Tell, tell the story. <laughs> this was my physiotherapist uh, at the beginning of uh, December. I, I blocked my neck uh, during <laughs> Harinam. So when I went to see him, he saw me he said, don't you do music? I said, yes. In Châtelet? Yes. <laughs> I remember you when I was a student. You were coming in front of my shop and playing and, and chanting Chichita. for hours and hours. Oh. And I thought it was like going to break my neck. <laughs> 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 but when I came back, actually, I gave him, I explained what we were doing, and he was very appreciative, actually. I said he will read it uh, during the winter. Uh, you gave it the Giza? Yeah. Is that the one that's mentioned here? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. That's the one. <laughs> so we've exactly got another one on, yeah? Well, amazing. Just see. Years, de decades ago, he saw the devotees chatting in front of the shop he was working in for hours on end, and now he's asking, what is this? Are you those people? Now he's taking a bag of Akita. Now he said, I'll read it during the winter. You may have been cracking your back or breaking your back. <laughs> this will break the backbone of his material life. You will never be the same again. Hare Krishna. That's it. <laughs> 2024 Prabhupada Book Marathon P. J. That's all the scores. We couldn't we didn't have time to go any further. That was it. That's it. Yeah. It's time for Prashadam. No? Time for lunch. <laughs> Good idea. And then, and we carry on. And here's another one. Rasika Braja Haridas. I don't even know who that is. <laughs> who knows who Rasika Braja Haridas? There were a few people who came through the Paris temple mm. and just did a book or so and mm. names went on the WhatsApp, but I can't remember who that is. Actually, Maharaj, that might have been one devotee visiting from the New York, oh, yes. New York temple. Yeah. And he was only in the temple for about three hours. Yes. And he was on his way to the airport. No, he took a lot more than that. Oh, he no. took about eight books. Uh -huh. He's a book distributor. He wanted to take French books to distribute in the airport. <laughs> but that's not him. Uh, I think he took about six books. I remember that. There's somebody. One book. Oja Sri Prabhu. One book. Haribo. India. And here in New Mayapur. Whoa. Where's his packet? Yeah. To give one to the kids as well. It's not, it's not here. Is he in the kitchen also? No, they're sick. Quarantine. Okay. Oh, oh dear, dear. What have they got? Nirmal Kumar Prabhu. Prabhu. And then in Paris, with one ma big book. Margopal Devi Dasi. He's in Saudi Arabia. And then, to try to fulfill his promise, I don't think he's here right now. No. Is he here? <coughs> In the kitchen, maybe. With one Mahabhi book. Back to Goncalo! Oh. Lisbon, he came to join us in the marathon. Doing a lot of backup service. Yes. And here in New Mayapur, with one big book, Mahabhi book. Giri Govran Prabhu! And he might be, he doesn't even know he did it, actually. And he gave a quote, so one, my big book, back to Evgeny. Oh. 
another one of those words I don't know how to pronounce. And somewhere along the line, our cowman, our woodman, with one uh, big book, Valade Prabhu! And in Paris, is this her first time um, on Sankatan? No, I she did distribution before, but for her first marathon. First marathon. So it we went out for a little short while, wasn't it? For half an hour. Half an hour. Back in Anupa with one Maha Big Book. Oh. In between, you missed somebody there. One, yeah, there. I see. I see. one, of, the, one of the big things this year was uh, the uh, involvement of many of the Bengalis in the marathon this year. They weren't going on the street much, but they were distributing books amongst their community. Doesn't <sighs> So this is one of them. Back to Asit with eight small books. And their beloved um, god sister and mother of our French Yatra, basically. With two books, Mandaki! Oh, she's always encouraging us. She loves so much to see the books are being distributed. Encouraging the devotees in book distribution. And this one I'll never be able to pronounce this. Someone who knows how to pronounce this Guillaume. name. William. Guillaume. Guillaume. Yeah. Sounds like Leon. William. That's what you're saying. So William. Guillaume. Four books. Guillaume. 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 William. Yeah. And he's he is related. Who's he who's he related to? Anastasia. Anastasia's husband, isn't it? Anastasia's husband. Amazing, I didn't even know. This is four books. Wonderful. And here's another one. I don't know if this is a first timer. First ever timer of doing books. Amazing. Just a short while or so with two books. Bakin? Yeah, Girl of Boy. Bakteen Granoli. Where is she from? Bengal. Bengal. Wow, wonderful. Another Bengal, you see. Mm -hmm. Free Rani got all kinds of people into this mm -hmm. box. And there we have it. Oh my goodness. I thought it was one book, but no, it's a box of books on its way to the battlefield with Bactagon Chalo, who almost daily supplies troops. <laughs> Uh, he was going out regularly with boxes of books, huh? <laughs> as well as helping in the kitchen. Yeah. Always ecstatic. Huh? He always ecstatic. He always loves to and He could stay there on his own for hours chanting. <laughs> Chattering. He would chant for hours on his own sometimes. Not so. yeah. He loves to And there's Yoga Maya. These are some of the devotees you've heard their names already. Disturbing her book. Just join us as I said a little bit. So then we're going now. We're going all the way to Martinique here. Wow. With ten oh. small books. Keshiha Prabhu. Oh. Do you know him? He's the, he's the pioneer of Krishna consciousness in Martinique. Wow. His father is a devotee. Uh, his sister was for the 50th anniversary of Paratashi this year. She came the two days. And from these two brothers mostly, I don't know if anyone here, but uh, from these two brothers, the whole Martinique has started. Wow. wow. So very wonderful devotee, wonderful service, and still distributing books. And then in Paris, Quite sure who this is. It's one of the Bengali community, I think. With five medium books back to Jai. Jai! One of our Bengali congregation. Jai, Jai, Jai. And here's a real turn up for the books. One of the new, a new devotee comes every day to the temple in Paris. Very simple man, very sincere, very devoted. He would come every every day and help me pack all the you know, old boxes and put them, you know, neat and tidy and everything. With one Arabic small book, he's from a Muslim family. Back to Mohammed. Bismillah, Bismillah. 
<laughs> you could probably tell by the name that his family was likely to be. He would go all, on every Harinam also. He was doing all the Harinams. Every single one would be there. If he could, on the Harinam. And he went with, uh, with you? No, with us. Yes. Who did no, he go with? No, with me. With Ekanath one day for a little while. And he just did one Arabic book on and then we have another member of our Hindu community with five Bengali community, five books back to Balai. Yeah, and here in New Mayapur. I don't know, I haven't seen her since she came back, but I guess she's around. With six books. Back in Chandni. Hari oh. She's sick also. Huh? She's also sick. She's also sick. Didn't do enough sankata. <laughs> There's a lot of sickness. Actually, our Sanctum party had a lot of sickness this year, too. Quite a bit. More than we would have liked. Even some of our Maharatis were out of action for some time. And then, this is an interesting one. Number 118 there with seven books. Um, someone is known to all the boys in Yamaipur, of course. Is uh, Back to Benwa. Are you all? Are you all? Oh, I'll tell you more about that later on. And then in Paris, with four books, back to Shirley. Hi. And in New Mayapur, I think she's here today. With 13 books, back to Marie. Hello. Hello. I won't be afraid of that long. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Yeah. Nothing will kill you. <laughs> back to God here. <laughs> Thank you, Marie. Back to Marie Kijai. Yeah. I don't see her very often on the bookstores. Then in Paris, uh, I think this is another member. No, maybe not. I'm not sure who this is. Utama, does anyone know? He's probably another member of our Hindu community. Probably. Utama Prabhu with four books. Hey, oh, oh, oh. And again, another member of Indian community. With four books, Ramalinga. I don't think that's an initiated name. He's a South Indian. And here in Mayapur, this is very inspiring. Okay. With two Mahabhi books, back to Marcel. I think if we were to do book distribution, he could probably do quite well. It'd be hard to say no. Take <laughs> 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 and we move on. A guy Pran. Was he that devotee from? He was the devotee from. Uh, with five books. A guy Pran Prabhu. Uh, he was uh, on his way to India, disciple of uh, the, the Kadapa Kanamraj. Mm. I thought it was Vaisheshika. I thought it was Prabhu. You're right. Vaisheshika Prabhu. Vaisheshika. And he was going to organize their retreat in. in January. He just took the books, he, he came for a few hours and distributed them. And then in Paris, our faithful devotion is serving the days here in Paris for decades and decades with two Mahabhi books Gopal Dasi, David Dasi. And whew, earth shattering score here. This is a really amazing. Another one of our Pajaras come cooks in, in Paris with two books. Goranga Pran Prabhu! He was very eager to have his name. You know. <laughs> That's my book. I, I just knew that book. I, I gave a Ramayan to somebody who said, No, no, I introduced him. He was going to put my name down. <laughs> so cute, yeah. And then, this is another nice one. Down in Avignon, one of the very old devotees, very senior Vaishnava, a wonderful devotee, with two books, two Mahabhik books. Gargacharya Prabhu. Oh. And in Paris, uh, tours rather, in tours, with four big four books, Madhvacharya Prabhu. Oh. Very senior devotee one and present of this temple at this time. He likes to give out books whenever he meets people, tries to introduce them. Still preaching. And in Paris, uh, with four books, Jagatharini Devidasi. Oh. And down in this. I gave her the district during the marathon. I presume she did through them. With uh, 15 mm, literatures, mostly magazines. 
Krishna Lila Devi Dasi. And here, uh, she was in Paris with an earth shattering score. He didn't quite make this quota. Um, but uh, with six books, Vidura Prabhu. Oh. Oh. Here, here. Oh. 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 Round and about. And now we're coming to a whole list of, uh, of Bengalis who all took, you know, ten books to distribute, one by one by one. Uh, we all with ten books, back to Sujit, back to Sapam, back to Rahul, back to Niraj, all with ten, ten books. <laughs> yeah. So there's a reason why we have Ben, why Ben was special. An auspicious start. The first book of the marathon was distributed in the holy land of Rishikesh, India, by our Dr. Benoit to three French pilgrims. Oh. Oh. He was a little hesitant. Just before he left, I said, look, you've got to take your books for the marathon and distribute them. So I gave him about eight books to take with him, and he just did them all, I think. And he was so happy, he couldn't believe it. He was meeting French people and giving him from those books. He should have taken more. That he was, he didn't think it was like that. You won't believe how many French people. We are just sending a consignment to Malaysia now, which was ordered and paid for during the marathon, of about 150 French books. Wow. They are for whoopers in our farm in Malaysia. 60% of the whoopers are French. Oh, wow. <laughs> We're sending Dutch books, German books, Portuguese books, Spanish books, Italian books. And other languages too, but over 75% of books we're sending are French. 20 liters, 50 life comes from life. This everything we've got, we're sending like 20, 30, 40 of each. Uh, French people all over the world are really interested in Krishna consciousness. In London, in England, there are at least eight, if not ten, full time French devotees who joined there, uh, young devotees, who, uh, some of them came through the volunteer program here, actually, first came in contact here. Now the big book distributor came through the volunteer program here. Yeah, so, you know, it's, it's, it's a different movement we're in now. It's not like, you know, the world is like almost one big kind of, you know, bubble. So, French people are taking interest all over the world. On the road again, there he is, Madura, missing his beloved Paris. <laughs> Favorite service, distributing books. He's feeling so much separation from book distributors. That's why he's not here, he can't bear it. <laughs> He'd be in tears if he were here now. He wouldn't be able to you know, make control of the motion. He's in tears off the street. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, he did. He tried for an hour and he did some books. So we go on. To that. Now we're down to the hundreds down. Another one of our, several of our Indian congregation here, they're all Bengals again. Karan, Chavan, Biplav, and Balaram, all with ten books. Yeah. At Rama Prabhu with three books. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. And in reunion with three books, Vaidyanath Prabhu. Yeah. There's a lot more devotees last year reported from reunion. There was about 30 devotees reported last year. This is only maybe six or seven only. Very few. One the, one, just the numbers they were doing it, but the numbers they were reporting also a very small. And then the devotee who does all this, um, uh, what's it, design for these banners and posters and so on. Very busy, but still joined us one day. And with three Bhagavad Gita's Gopika Kanta Devi Dasi. Many of you know her. She lives near Paris. And also, very well known to most of the old devotees, with three books, Bhakin Anastasia. And this is another surprise one. On the last night, New Year's Eve, he joined us for the Hari Nam. I was speaking to him before we started. He said, well, it's the last day of the year. I better leave this end, end of the year on an auspicious note. 
Um, so I thought I'd better come and join you on Harinam. So he joined us on Harinam. And, uh, and at the end, he stood next to the party office, to my right there, and he was stopping people going by. And he actually sold, literally stopped people, preached them, and sold three Bhagavad Gita's in a short while back to Adarsh. Yeah. 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 That's his first time. That's actually his initiative name from a different Sampradaya. Oh, he's not in our, is it, is it which Sampradaya? It's some weird. Mm. <laughs> not a Gaudi Vaishnava Sampradaya. They apparently said they come from Nityananda, but uh, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> say no more. They appreciate, they appreciate the Sankirtan movement very much. Yeah. They, they like to chant the Maha Mantra. They do. Okay, yeah. good, good. But anyway, Lord Chandra is engaged in distributing Prabhupada's book, so that's a really wonderful step for them. And here in New Mayapur, I've a bit uh, devotee with five books. Raja Dharma Prabhu! Association named their Ishana. So they just read five books. Hey. Hey. And then we go down again. Others, that means odds and ends, which didn't really go under the name of name here in New Michael Cameron. This be this one. But with 40 literatures, others. Hey. 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 Seven books, 
Sudevi Manjari Devi Dasi. I got that one. <laughs> 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 they already got it. Oh, <laughs> 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 no, you got it back. They gave it back. Give it back. And in Mayapur. Actually, not in Mayapur. I think it was in Reunion, if I'm not mistaken. But our dear Vaishnavi with seven books. Krishna Charna Vidya. Thank you so much. That evolved. Now, who knows who that is? Is that Subra? Is that Jai Jagannath's wife? Oh, it's. No. No, it's, it's, for, from it's Mauritius. Mauritius. I think it's Mauritius. Yeah. I could work out because there was no name. I think that's for the Sankt Antibody of Mauritius, yes. who inspired back to you. Yeah, that's it. Yes. And so we don't know. But she's very enthusiastic. She's very nothing to do with us. But Yumi was in Mauritius, and they were going out together on book. So there we go on. The next one, Honesty Box. <laughs> Actually, the honesty. There's no room for honesty around here. I made the honesty box. I credit. I arrange it. I cancel it. I organize it every day. I get the sweets. And I actually did more than that. It's a complicated story. But the honesty box, we just stick it in the temple room in Paris with a nice donation box next to it with no Bengali and Tamil and, and French and English signs, please take a book and give a donation in the box. We collected over about 200 euros in the box in donations. There was more books distributed than that, actually, probably about 50% more. So anyway, here it says 45 books, and uh, the honesty box, Jai! Jai! And then, oh my goodness, <laughs> I can't believe this. I cannot believe it. This is embarrassment to Sonam. He came all the way to Brazil to take part in the marathon. And this degree is the incredible quantitative score of eight books. None other than Goranga Prema! Oh. What happened? <laughs> Portuguese Don't just give that as an excuse every time. Je ne comprends pas français. What's that mean? <laughs> I don't That's not an excuse either. <laughs> Don't give these excuses. How can you leave this country with a score like this? <laughs> keep him here. Huh? He wants to keep you here. Right? So doing about eight books in next year's marathon. <laughs> Actually, he ended up doing all the temple services. Ninety percent of the time, he was in the temple, cooking, doing daily worship, shopping, cleaning, organizing services. You name it. Also carrying uh, heavy books. Sometimes, <coughs> not so much. Not like us. A couple of times, two or three times. He did more than all of us, Maj. He did more than all of us. Yeah. He ate more. Than <laughs> That's a wonder where all the cookies wrapped right now. One box was just in my room. <laughs> One box missing, huh? Yeah. Anyway, thank you for joining us. Hare Krishna. He did all the backup services in the temple to help. As the Bhaktisara was also helping. And then a yoga program, a Kirtan program, with ten books. Ramaji and Ali Ganga. And then um, why? He joined us for about two or three hours. He was in Paris for a few days over Christmas. Came racing over. And with 15 books, back to Baptiste. And Lyon. With 12 books, back to Narina. And he knew my book. Well, she wasn't in my book. She was in Paris. And she was going out. Sometimes on Sankatan in Paris. Just before.
before she left. I know she's here today. Is she here with us? No. Uh, she, where is she now? Moldavia. Moldavia? Yeah. In Moldavia. What's she doing there? <laughs> long, long, long story. <laughs> They're waiting to come back. <laughs> so, uh, with 24 books, Castori Vangioi, David. 24! And then, oh wait, here we go. <laughs> now the real fun begins. <laughs> with a world record score. Yeah. Tripling her score last year. She tripled her score. More than tripled. With 13 books. Including eight Bhagavad Gita. Bhakim Sangita! Youngest worldwide participants in the book marathon, probably. I'm sure there's a few others, but I'm sure she's amongst the, the youngest. And then a reunion with 24 books. Pavana Radha Devi Dasi and Radha Pari Prabhu. Well, they weren't really in reunion, that was just one day in reunion. They were in Mauritius almost the whole time. They didn't really do a marathon this year. They just did one day or two in, in, in reunion with they came back. Last year, you can see his score, they had 600 book points last year. This year, only 18, so oh, yeah. quite a big difference. And this is one of the reasons their score was a bit less than last year, because other things like that. And then, right, you know, one of, like one of their local devotees is not feeling very well. They're sick right now, but they went out in tours on that wonderful day of Gita Jayanti. It was a real, that was the best day of the marathon, Gita Jayanti, so many the boys went out from here on book distribution and in Paris. And it was a really exciting day, really exciting. And we said, you both were the same. We had 10 books each in tours. Brisha Bano Sutta Devi Dasi and Nandini Devi Dasi. And then also in reunion together with others. Um, we had 12 books. Now that they go for Swami Prabhu! Oh, 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 oh. 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 Huh? Reunion. No. No, not the name. This one I, I will remember. It's all man. I went to him. A little louder. Oh no, all man. I, uh, And then in Paris with six books. She was busy looking sir, looking after her husband and managing the temple. <laughs> with six books. Basumati Manjari Devi Dasi. She actually had a, a knee injury. She was hardly able to do anything. With 16 books, she's actually, they say, the best book this year in reunion, but hardly able to go out at all. With 16 books, Dayalu Radha Devi Dasi! And then, whoa! Wow. Whoa, don't, don't give the game away. With 78 books, here and there, and here in New Mayapur, somewhere or another. None other than Gorangi Devi Dasi! That was a high catch. And 
and you triple, more than triple your score last year. Wow. More than triple. And in Puras, I think they're here. Are they still here? They were here yesterday. Taxi Gopal and Rai, are they still here? No, they've gone. Well, in Puras, in Rai, David Alsi with 27 books. And, ooh, last minute score. This is actually the last score to come in, I think. With 32 books. The reception table in New Mayapur. Who's there? Who's that? What's her name? Sibiria. No, the other lady. Where is she? Is she here? Reception. Where is she? Someone grip back to the reception. Give her this. And then, New Mayapur. I guess in tours on Sankatan. With 33 books. Back to mice! Are you here? Mice! He's sick. He's sick. He's also sick. He was here earlier on. It's the beginning of the year. And then in Paris, this is all sorts of things happen. People take books and then they don't come back, you know. <laughs> they go on Harry now, you know, they send out 100 magazines. No one reports a single book magazine distributed, only 13 come back. <laughs> Most of those don't report the magazine. So <laughs> collective build up. <coughs> so, with a uh, hundred assortments here, uh, Paris, others, I guess that's me as well. I'm building up packets of sweets here. And then in Paris, very enthusiastic. He really wanted to be a part of the marathon this year with 27 books. Baba Cinder Prabhu! And also in Paris, uh, he stole someone's name by the looks of it. We call him Dubai. Dubai. <laughs> With 50 books, Dubai Petit Pavanadas. He was on Dubai. And he's one of the new main kind of like innovative preachers in Paris. And then here in New Mayapur, well, I think these books were actually books she purchased to send to somebody down south. With 15 books, mm -hmm. huh? did she go on the street? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a different money manager. Yes, of course it is. I know another one. With 15 books, our beloved head Pajari. Money manjari, David Yes, she's there. Yes, she's there. Behind the column, Maras. She be on the curtain. Take a book, 
Please take a book, not a bone. That's what it's supposed to be. French. Is that right? He's preaching to the woofer. Take a book, don't take a bone. The dogs usually like bones, don't they? So she's trying to convince the dog to take a book. Did they take a book in Africa? Yes, and she actually, okay, if you want the, the story, yeah. Yeah. we were going on the um, Gita Jayanti tours with uh, Mani Ma, with um, Manjuali and Mahadevi, and they are with Sangita. And on the way, we decided to stop at the post office because Manjuali has to uh, put something at the post office. This in Ekeye? In Ekeye. These two ladies look at us very suspicious why they parked in front of our door. <laughs> what they want from us. <laughs> and so I, I tell Mon I tell Mahadevi, let's give them a book. <laughs> so I give a book to Sangita, I say, give a book to this lady, and we open the window, and <laughs> Sangita says, hello. So the two ladies are like, oh, hello, <laughs> cute little girl. <laughs> and then Sangita is giving the book <laughs> by the window. And this lady is saying, for who is the book? And Sangita says, she shows her, her, not the other one. And you could see the other one really didn't want the book. <laughs> and this one was like, this is for me? And then she looks at me and she's like, can I keep the book? And I said, yes, my daughter wants to give it to you. Wow, thank you, I will read it. Thank you so much. It's so nice to meet people like this. <laughs> and the dog looks pretty interesting. <laughs> <laughs> so even in a we can make this. <laughs> yeah, very well. And then that one on the right is some... Uh, so like a restaurant cafe thing, isn't it? Some uh, sweet maker in the streets of Tours, so Sangita really was hoping that this uh, Prabhu would give her some sweet <laughs> He did take the book, but he didn't give any sweets. <laughs> it's a famous shop, that Madeleine. Yeah, famous shop in Tours. Cafe, restaurant, whatever they are. And here he is. The man behind the scenes in action on the front lines. Who can stop a true blue army? Although he's not dressed in blue yet. Unfortunately, it's maybe the last year we will have the invaluable support of the army. Oh, no. No. Don't ask me. <laughs> What's the answer to that? The question was why. Why? Why? Well, if someone can move New Zealand a little closer to France. <laughs> <laughs> move New Zealand, but it, it will be, don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> I was told that one time, don't worry, everything will be in this zone one day. <laughs> <laughs> what to do? No, he's moving to New Zealand. And he'll probably be settling down there in New Zealand, serving there, and probably working there also. Unlikely to be free in the months of December. What to do? Krishna will provide. So we move on, and then here in up there in Paris, and this is a wonderful score. Really, she's one. She actually lived in Lyon. She's studying in Lyon. This personality um, didn't know that the boys were in Lyon. So no friend came to Paris. He got the address of the temple. Came a few back at the beginning of the marathon. And I can't remember exactly what happened there, we met her, talked to her, and met with Kriarani. And I said, take, keep her contact for you. Then she said, I'd like to come back, Christmas time or something. She came back and came out several days on Sankatan. Two days, two, days, two or three days on Sankatan, and just used 23 books. Back to Manasvini! She's also from originally. from? Originally from? Very, very nice young lady. Very nice devotee. Real devotee. Real devotee. And then annually every year, uh, takes part in the marathon, buys books, distributes them here and there. With 70 books, our godbrother, Prabhupada disciple, Maharishi Prabhu. And I think very busy this year, Nitai. Yeah, 1,000 calendars by post. Yeah. Means every day in the post office. Every day going to the post office. He's also looking after your mother-in-law. Yeah. And Mania. Two blind persons. They're both blind. Mania has gone blind. <coughs> and his mother-in-law is also blind. 
and he tried to do a few festivals at the weekend that he went for the weekend it just poured with rain mm. it was one weekend it just rained and rained and rained wow. and he got kind of washed out but still something went out so with 33 books his grace Nitai go Sundar Prabhu! Oh, that was easy. Yes, <laughs> no mercy, they say every time. Oh, yeah. For the first person I heard say mercy, but I offered them something. Oh, yeah. Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, his life is a marathon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, around. And decades and decades of marathons. Decades. And then. Here in New Mayapur, always loves to hear about the book distribution, do whatever they can to support and take part in it. With 154 pieces of literature, books, Leela Maduri Devi Dasi! Oh. Combined between her and her husband, they speak very much. And in Paris, this is another coming out of the, out of the cave. <laughs> they think, and he, every, almost, almost every day of the marathon, he'd come to me with a, a coupon. You know these, uh, what do you call these? Ticket restaurant. Ticket restaurant. Like a ticket coupon, you know. He gets them from the social service office or something. And he's got a little bit of you know, physical defects. And uh, he has these wads. Every day he'd come and give me one bag of a Gita. He wants to take Gita a day to give to somebody. Every day. Almost every day. Right. Yeah. With 23 Mahabhik books. Krishna Prasad! Back to Krishna Prasad Prabhu! And also, there's another one of your, I think, volunteers. Um, I don't know them, I can't remember. I think I do. It's a long time back. Somehow or another, they distributed books somewhere. They bought a box of Gita's and they sent the score in somehow or other during the marathon. With 24 Bhagavad Gita's, Back to Shiva! Haribo! Oh, Shiva Das, I'm not sure he's Shiva initiated das. somewhere. Shiva Das. Shiva das. Huh? Shiva das. Where's he initiated somewhere or not? Shiva Nanda. Shiva Nanda. Shiva Nanda. So many, I know you many didn't know him, but uh, special participant in that book distribution. He's here currently. He's huh? upstairs. Yeah, he's he's here. Here. Is he here now? He's sick. Yes. Uh, he's sick. Oh, he's sick again. He's sick. No. He's ah, sick, but he's upstairs. That'll make it better. Whoa. And in Paris, although working and doing daily worship and not getting, and being, you could say, the other Bengalis are taking all the spots now. But with 59 books, Rajendra Manava Prabhu! Oh, oh. Oh. And again, another explore these score. He's not here. Is he? But with 37 books, Coming, wasn't there for most of the marathon, but for some of it. Coming out sometimes and starting her book distribution. I don't know if she'd done book distribution before. Has she been out before? First time ever on book distribution. Bhaktin Doina. She's here. There she is. Mind your head. You bet when I throw this, you all got to watch your heads. When I throw this. Even though there's someone over there, it might hit the head of someone over there. You never know. And watch your head. They have this sign, watch your head, huh? And, yeah, and then, okay, we'll move on. With 48 books, this year she was really enthusiastic, I must say. But in Kalpana in Paris, Haribo! Oh. And in Paris, also very enthusiastic. And the main one who got all the Beng other Bengalis to history books, really. With 85 books, Tamal Krishna Prabhu! And he just took second initiation yeah. three days ago. Mm. And here in Mayapur, I didn't expect this. I've seen all those services, but with 33 books. Mandurali Devi Dasi! Is she here? She's cooking. Kitchen. Cooking the feast along with others. Wow. And here's another another star of the star of yeah. the marathon. That's a real star. With 60 books. Wow. Between Lyon, Paris, I don't know where he was back and forth. His family and this and that. The 60 books. Back to Eric! And in Paris, with 48 books. Now they have to change the name, don't they? Now? Who remembers her new name? Saranya. With 48 books. Saranya Devi Dasi! Oh, this is too dangerous. Gorangi is somewhere in between.
between the two of us. I really have got some fun that wasn't bad. It would have been a breakthrough between us. Perfect. Thank you, sir. Alias Sophia. And in reunion with uh, 85 books, Jai Jagannath and Sabhadra Mai Devi Dasi. You see, last year they did 10 times more in book points last year. Um, mainly because they just did a lot of Bible count sets. They did about 10 sets last year. And the last, no, it's not the last, on this, it's the last on this page. We're seven with uh, no books at all. <laughs> That's the Bhagavatam set. Though. Oh yeah, one Bhagavatam set, exactly. The Bhagavatam set didn't turn up on this page. One Bhagavatam set, Devashi Prabhu! He's probably in India or Africa or somewhere, I don't know where he is. <laughs> and then in Nazi, with 300 small books, and the grand total of 75 book points, Janaran and Abhyasat Devi Dasi. Alias, who knows who they are? Jad. Last year they just did the quid of the book. Last year they scored 5,635 book points between them. This year 75. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> <laughs> and now, Gurus, do you mind me, Michael? Also cooking or not? Yeah, cooking? apparently. Yes. yes or no? Maybe cooking in the kitchen. Uh, but with a um, 59 books, mainly Mahabe. Sunday go, Papa! The family here? His wife is just here. She just arrived. His wife just arrived on the nick of time. Where is he? I can't see him. His wife is here. She needs one. Person, yeah. There's two for you. Kimitra? This is you. And then, aha, coming in towards the end of the marathon in Paris. Oh, he's here. Flew, flew in at the end and went out on and off here and there sometimes. <laughs> cooking for the devotees also nice supper when they came back and helping get books for Harini and different other little bits and pieces that are still going out sometimes with 62 books. Kamala Sundari Devi Dasi. In the kitchen, is she? Everyone's in the kitchen. We should do the program in the kitchen. <laughs> And again, one of those mystical scores that came in the middle of the marathon. I don't know how she did it. It wasn't even here. It was 143 books. Bhagavati Devi Dasi. Yeah. Oh, that is, she didn't report her scores for like six months and she said them during the December marathon. <laughs> and here's another star of the show. More than five times this score last year with 82, wow. 82 books, mostly Mahabhi books. His Grace Jyoti Prabhu! Jyoti Prabhu! I'm going to scroll back because probably. Uh, put your head up higher, I can't see it. Yeah. There we go. And in Paris, actually, a very good book distributor, but didn't get any time working and gone to Italy and Belgium and here and there. With 45 books. Veni Madhavi Devi Dasi! Five Arabic Jesus. She actually sold them on the street. And here we see some of those heroes. Here's Jyoti in action on the street and at home. Jyoti's got the bugs for books. There he is. No one could get past him. Every guest who came had to take at least one of Prabhupada's books. Huh? There's another one in Tourist, there's Manjuali in action, and Bhishabana, Sutta Devi Dasi in action, and Gita in action, all just doing books. Manjuali there, blitzing tours, even the traveling nun couldn't escape the mercy. <laughs> <laughs> I should could not escape the mercy, not could not escape the mercy. Could not, that should be a knock in between. I'm not sure. Maybe they did escape, I'm not sure. But they shouldn't have escaped. <laughs> Not, not, I think Sangeeta, I thought it was like a teddy bear there. 
I think that's Sangeeta underneath the nun, isn't it? Yes. Looks like a teddy bear on the side. It does, it's a, I saw the coat on the other side. I don't know. <laughs> Combined effort there between Manjuali and Sangeeta. Yeah. Here is this film. And there's Eric in action. Leon looks remarkably like his brother, I must say. <laughs> It is, brother. <laughs> it's just like his brother. I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> they're in a bar, or where are they? It looks like they're having a few, a few rounds going. <laughs> I think that's why he took the book. <laughs> are they Chinese? He's from Vietnam, isn't he? Laos. Yeah. Laos. From Laos. From Laos. Kind of Chinese. Yeah, they're probably, so there's lot, mostly Chinese people in Laos. And there she is. Who's that? Who knows who that is? Kamala, Kamala Sundari. In action. Yeah, I'm not too bad as cause. You want that people to like, stop it? I'm like, oh. Oh. And there's Saranya. Come on. Two books at once. In the station, there she is again. Not afraid, you know. Oh, gentlemen, man. <laughs> fearless, she was with Harini. When she was ready with Harini, you get fearless. Right? <laughs> there you go on, 38. Here in New Michael with 104 books. Madhavendra Puri Prabhu! Oh, oh, no. Is he here? Is he here? Oh, no. no, he's giving class. Is he here? Is he here? Yeah. No. 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 Yes, he is here. No. No. No, no, no. Ah, no. I That's Rama. Yeah. 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 And then with uh, 85 books down in Rodez. Wow. They do markets on the weekends, in the week, during the day. They do the markets. With 85 books. Mukunda Madhava Prabhu and Sumuki Devi Dasi.
quite a big hall, I think at least 400 people there. So they distributed 80, 80 Bhagavad Gita. They bought them in the back. And we're forward, here we go. Top 32 with, what have we got here? Wow. 100 books and one set of Srimad Bhagavatam. Queen Gandharaka. Oh. He's going for initiation very shortly. That's all we know. But it's not, I thought it was next week, but it's not. Yeah, it's changing. Mm. And another wonderful example, although personally disappointed because last year he was more involved and didn't have much time this year for obvious reasons. But with 120 books and one Chaitanya Charitam Rita set, his grace, Jeeva Pran Prabhu. Where is he? Where is he? Is he there? Oh, that's <laughs> 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 We missed one. Oh, we missed one. Thank you for noticing that one missing. In 27th spot, from Martinique with three Bhagavatam sets, Jai Bhakti Devi Dasi. <laughs> 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 Uh, we have a few more for the others. Um, and it's interesting to note, she did exactly the same last year, three Bhagavatam sets. <laughs> <laughs> exactly the same. <laughs> the points are exactly the same thing. And then in 26 place, with 120 books and one Chaitanya Charitam Rita set, a wonderful wow. example. Wow. Managing the temple in Paris to get a double dose here. Yeah. Right? Wow. <laughs> It's very Jeeva, Jeeva Pran Prabhu. Oh. Jeeva Pran, not for you. He did everything in the temple, no problem. 
Hey, you've got two packets. Uh, they didn't get out much, actually. Circumstances were such they didn't get much opportunity to get out. Um, when they did go out, they did it remarkably well. And, uh, but there's, there's some other things were going on which prevented them from going out. But with 234 books, back uh, in Eleanor! Bravo! Mahananda Prabhu, who was normally was supposed to be helping me, he went to Portugal for a while. He actually got sick when he went to Portugal. Came back really sick. And he was completely out of it. I mean, he was just on his back since the day he got back from Portugal to now. That's when he was able to do a few of those things. He was able to drive the car here, fortunately. Other than that, it was a big we met for nothing. Um, so, it was just a few hours. But Eleanor probably has got the same thing. He's probably come down with a jagged bird. But uh, then we go on, and this is another one of those incredible results, really speaking. He would come from Bois, to Paris, well, at least once a week, and take a suitcase of books and go back to Bois and sell them on her own in the car park, in the shopping cart. Arabic books, French books, to the public, on her own. And she would sell them and bring all the money back and take a lot more books the next week. And she would sometimes go out in Paris. With 181 books, Amala Bhakti Devi Dasi! Really enthusiastic. She's doing a lot of service in Paris. And in Paris, um, again we have to change this name, huh? with 170 books. He wanted to do more than last year, but didn't quite make it. Oh, no. You've got six hours left. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> quite make it. Uh, but the, what, the column on the right is, by the way, I've done it for a few doors, is what they did last year in points. And the column next to it, the second from the right, is this year's you can see, like with Amala Bhakti, she's increased ten times from last year. But Ali is almost identical with last year. Now, uh, with uh, 170 points, Chandra Mukhi Devi Dasi! Hey, oh. 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 <laughs> you don't want to? <laughs> and as I said, because of circumstances beyond the control, uh, with 418 books, Mostly in Portugal, of course, small books when he was there with Nitya Chanjal. Um, with 418 books. Uh, Mahananda Prabhu! Aigo! Oh, very, very, very sick. <laughs> it's not got COVID. It's, it, he went for a full check. It's not. But it's some heavy, heavy flu. It's going around. There's lots of people with it. Apparently. And then with 137 books. This is another exceptional. Really speaking, he's also in his 80s. And he would come at least twice a week. First week he came and said, Oh, only five books this year, I'm too old. And he took five books to distribute amongst the Tamils. And then the weekend he came back, I want more. And he kept coming, he must have come eight times during the marathon five books, ten books, five books, ten books, like that. And he did one Bible Tam set as well. With 137 books, 102 liters, 137. Books all together on one camel bag with them said, Go for another promo! He's a real. And not only that, he comes to the camel, gets his books, and he goes straight in the garden and starts gardening. Yeah. And he's like 80 what? 83? 83. Mm -hmm. Just see. In Sri Lanka. He just read 500 Bhagavad Gita from Sri Lanka. So, you know, let's think about this, you know. I mean, okay, we're poor, weak, whatever we are, but this man is 83 years old. He's not in good health at that. He is, and he is he's strong. But he's had a lot of sicknesses, too. And he's not going to stop serving Prabhupada till he's died. He's not yeah. dead. And we're saying, well, I'm too tired, I'm too old, I'm too this nonsense. Mm. Think about it. We're here to serve. That's why we exist. 
There's no purpose of the existence of the soul except the service. That's its one and only function. To please Krishna. It has no other purpose of existence. It will only exist in his service. What we serve, how we serve, quantity, all secondary. But we have to remember that our very existence is only for service. Robert White said, isn't that what he said? It's only, the only question you need to ask is how are you? You have to think about it. We're not here to lay around being lazy, gossiping, fault-finding, rumoring, wasting our time on WhatsApp, this, this app, that app. We're here to serve. Don't waste this human life. And then we have anonymous. And anonymous simply remains anonymous. It's before Srimad Bhagavatam said. Anonymous ki jai. It's easy to work out who anonymous is watching the scores. I can hear him sweet. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> Definitely anonymous. <laughs> we'll give him to some anonymous person after this. So you can work out who is if you've been closely watching the scores, which you probably haven't because you haven't had them to watch. <laughs> one score's been going up and one score's been going down during the marathon. Yeah. The same person was anonymous, but they became a person. <laughs> At a certain point during the miles. So it came off the anonymous score. Well, the first one. Yes, you know, a long story. And here we are, reunion. This is Jagannath, Jai Jagannath, right? Jai Jagannath. Yes. Jai Jagannath. On his book table, I'm sorry I haven't got a picture of his wife. She wasn't in the picture, but they do it together. And others also join them. They're very active in book distribution. They distribute. Today we read it out. They just did the Bible time set yesterday and a whole bunch of other books. They're very enthusiastic book distributors. A lot of Tamil Indians there. They know. Lots of them. This is obviously not a Tamil. Presumably huh? French. And here we are in Mayapur in the home base. Lochananda and Gandharvika set an example themselves, distributing books at every opportunity we have. A team, are they from Andhra Pradesh? Tamil Nadu. <coughs> Tamil Nadu. A team of Tamilians, and they want to build a temple or what? Yes. But Lord Venkateshwara. They want to build a temple of Venkateshwara, right here in France in Paris. Well, a few families yes, walk away. The, the main one is in the, the, from the second. In the middle? Yeah, yeah. it's left side of the second. In the middle, with a blue, blue and red jacket. Uh, the or the black jacket. Grey one. Brown. 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 Brownie black. White one. Oh, the brown. The, the solid brown. Yeah. yeah. Brown and black. Yeah. White one. Has been, they host all the swamis from uh, from India. Yeah. Yeah. They go went and saw the prime minister mm -hmm. of India. Yeah, quite significant. Quite active. Yeah. So they were here. No chance. So when the Andhra received them, <coughs> they took away Bhagavatam set also. Yeah, we get it. set and Bible teaching. And there they are getting their Bible yes. time set. Uh, this is a different group. Oh, there's a different group. Yeah. So the two, you did one and your wife did one. Another group of Indians who came, get ready, get set. Get the Bible time <laughs> set, go. The mountain is on, it's the highest class. They are like electricians, plumbers, we have all the crew we need. So they're going to come and start working in our kitchen from next week. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Very good. So get go. Get ready, get set, go. <laughs> yeah. You can tell. <laughs> Punjabis are quite distinct, aren't they? They've got a sort of strong facial features and strong hair across the hat. The one holding the Bible. The qualified electrician. His name is Mandeep. And there's Gandharvik on the streets of Tours. And uh, they wrote the letter on that day. If I give you a Mercedes, will you take a book? <laughs> oh, so easy to get people to take books, huh? <laughs> we never have a status to give, but anyway, interesting to see if they would. Oh, there we go. Well, even if we can't enthuse animals, we can at least enthuse at least human beings to this path of Hare Krishna Mantra chanting. Pashu Pakiri Pashu Mantra It's so nice that even the most stone hearted man would be that. Passion Alliterate means stone, Alliterate. Passion, even stone will melt. 
He was so nice. <laughs> Did he give a donation? <laughs> Pebbles. <laughs> no, he, he was a mendicant. A mendicant? Yeah, yeah, he had nothing. <laughs> No, no, it's in statue, it's in statue, it's all right. He said you already had the big edition in his own hand. It's not the big edition in the other hand, you can see it, you see it. He's got the big bag of in the other hand there, you see. It's a lot of tradition. He wanted a paperback one also. Maybe he'll distribute it. Okay. And there they are, Jeeva Pran and, and Chandra Mukhi in action in Paris. Oh, excuse me. What happened here? We changed the pictures around, so that's a wrong <laughs> caption. Yeah, yeah. It was the yeah, right picture, slow. but because she appeared on a different section of the photo, we moved her over to the other section, but we didn't move the caption. So that should be, of course, Chandra Mukhi there in action, not the Manjari. So see the, the picture that goes with the caption later on. And there we are in the train. A lot of books were distributed. This year we had, as we said earlier, we can distribute books in Spain, Ukraine, in a plane, in a crane, in a drain, and, and also in a train. <laughs> so many books were distributed in the train this year. Many. In fact, Torini spent many days just going up and down between South Salazar and on the train. <laughs> Didn't get off the train. Well, changed trains, I think. Sometimes stayed on the same train if it was a movement track to And back and forth like this. Especially when it was wet, wet windy, and cold. Yeah. Not a bad place to go. Yeah. But the train is all, you know, half the whole train is open. That, that train is not like a metro. So there's Eleanor distributing three and one there. Triple mercy on the train. <laughs> and there's Amala Bakhti in action. Sorry about the photo, uh, photograph. Somebody got distorted somewhere else. Amala Bakhti and Bakhti, no longer Sophie either. In, in action in Shuffle, they are the whole places. Nineteenth place. Well, look at that. That late score also. Sixty-three books, three Sriman Bhagavatam set. None of them. Most of you don't even know who they are. <coughs> Member of our congregation. Lives in Oak there. Am I saying it correctly? Oak there. Oak there. Oak there. Okay. Town between Paris and Dijon. On the, on the highway. He has a, a, a big uh, second-hand warehouse there. And he loves to kiss you folks. Madhava Charna Vinda Prabhu. Big rise on Master. And then 18th place in Grey Union. Um, of course, Dr. Swami Prabhu and Krishna Charna Vinda were there with him. With 115 books, one cheat CC set, one Bhagavatam set. Daini Prabhu and Vrindarani Devi Dasi. And then. Oh, not to be outdone. <laughs> Empowered by the cows and the bulls and my <laughs> Focused on serving their own men, bringing pleasure to the cows and the bulls. In Paris for one week only, with 163 books, almost exclusively to you, a bag of Agitas. Namashaya Prabhu! Yeah, they eat Kaddishi these sweets. Uh, no. Don't oh, eat them. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that happened in Paris one day. I, I, I kind of take cookies every day on, 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 on even on the Kaddishi. But, I suppose they, they, you know, they said, they, well, I didn't realize they were thinking of themselves. They would come up and take a cookie to give to some of their creatures. Someone said, can I take a cookie? Yeah, sure, take it, take it. For but they ate it themselves. <laughs> that happened several times, apparently. <laughs> he broke the card. But he gave the example of um, how Bhakti Siddhartha Maharaj, although he's known for his strictness, when it came to preaching, he said to his Bengali disciples, if you have to eat rice on the Kadashi to preach, then eat rice. We're here to preach, we're not here to eat. Prabhupada said the same thing to Hari Kesh when he went to uh, Eastern Europe. He was trying to get out of Eastern Europe. Prabhupada said him, Prabhupada, I can't stay there. I don't want to stay there. Prabhupada said, you must stay there. No, I can't stay there. But I can't even find anything to eat there. There's only meat to eat. And Prabhupada said, then eat meat. 
we call it a preach not to eat. Uh, we don't go to the extreme, but I mean, you know, it's, it's by accident sometimes these things come, so we get to see that. Then we move on. And again, another wonderful in, uh, in service endeavor with 68 books and three Srimad Bhagavatam sets, one of the longest serving <coughs> book distributors, I say longest serving in time, that is. Um, also very senior, I don't know how old he is, 70? I'm not sure. No, he's in his 60s. He's still in his 60s. He looks, I think his life has made him look older than he is. He's yeah. a very difficult life, no doubt about that. Uh, with 68 books and three Bhagavatam sets, Chakrada Prabhu! Adi and here, their first marathon here in New Mayapur. Um, not with us the whole time, maybe a couple of weeks, I can't remember. Um, it's wonderful to see. Um, with 198 books. Leela Manjari Devi Dasi! Here. Is she here? Oh, watch what I'm doing. Jai. So we're getting up there now. Any comments? Now we're getting to some comments. Oh, Namachari, you have any comments? Hmm. Say something. <coughs> no, Namachari. <laughs> 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 we're just doing books to make comments. Any comments? So, um, <coughs> I got one, one story, yeah, well, one, one that I remember, that uh, I was distributing books to some men, and I just turned away, and another man just was just staying in front of me. And, and he was start to speak with me in French, like something, déjà vu, déjà vu, déjà vu. And I was like, okay. And he said, can you make selfie? Can you make, make selfie? Mm -hmm. I say, well, usually I not do those things, but okay, let us do, you know. <laughs> he make selfie with me. And he right away take out five euro from the pocket. He said, it's five euro, yeah, it's five euro. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, yeah, that's nice. <laughs> 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 and I gave him bag of gifts and he was so happy and he just ran away. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you can try this trick and you know, take a photo and make it with some kind of special person. You can try it also, indeed. Lila Manjari, you have a comment? Where is she? Yes. Would you like to say anything about your marathon in Paris? I, I like the spirit. Uh, the I, like it. Nice. No mic. I can hear. I can hear someone speak from top of it. I like the spirit that we were all distributing together. It was amazing because whenever we didn't have energy, we would um, like cheer up. The boys were out. Yeah. And I like that. It was uh, so amazing. And even the food distribution in the train that was very new to me, but uh, it was fun. We were making fun with it, and somehow it was working. So right. very nice. Yeah, second time to be fun, not fun, especially when the boys are together. Feed off each other, you can you know, feel the spirit going through. Thank you. And then we have, oh, this is a phenomenal score because this devotee was very busy with many services throughout the day and the night, literally. Would I be correct to say Jiva Prah? Where is Jiva Prah? Is he here? Yeah. Am I correct to say? I just keep some yeah, on my there is just yeah, a Oh, <laughs> yeah, there's another one in between. Thank you. Yeah, well, this devotee was also very busy with us. So yeah. <laughs> what about the night, but at least in the day. <laughs> a wonderful, wonderful inspiration for us all here in Nimaipur, amongst other services, but encouraging others also, distributing books themselves, organizing the book for the math, for the Harinam, and this and that. With 116 books, six Srimad Bhagavatam sets, were they online? I don't know if she's here. She's yeah. there. Were they online? Yeah. Online. Through WhatsApp. Through WhatsApp. Wow. You see, they can be done. <laughs> Through WhatsApp. Six stream of Bible Town Fair. <laughs> Chitralila Devi Dasi! <laughs> Thank you. Very good. Anything you'd like to say? A lot of the books that we were distributing on Harinam um, were sponsored, so I'd like to thank all the sponsors, even though they're not all here, but um, among them was Vishnisha, for example, Ananda Mandri. We got 1,200 euros of sponsorship, so it helped to distribute a lot more books. 
Yeah. They just do book. She put up some. Didn't you put it on GoFundMe or something like that? Yeah. And you catch a lot of money on GoFundMe. Huh? Yeah. And divorce from all over the world. Some divorce. But I heard that. Uh, what's his name? Um, Dharma. What's his name? <coughs> Dharmatma. Dharmatma. I heard he gave money for the sponsoring books and stuff. I mean, a lot of people like didn't know. Who yeah, Dharmatma made a donation. Yeah. Sponsorship. That was here in Newmarket. So the area they give a lot of books out, maybe cheaply and, and easily, and, and tours and so on. That's very, very nice. Thank you. And uh, now, with a hundred, uh, three hundred, amongst many other services, am I on the right number now? Mm. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Amongst many other services in the temple yes. and outside the temple also. Here, there, and everywhere, going everywhere, going to programs, going shopping making the garland, cooking, cleaning, looking after guests, what else she does? Cooking. Yeah, cooking I mentioned. Encouraging already. others to distribute. Encouraging, taking others, encouraging others. Doing Harry Doing Harry Making garland. Bringing books. That's what else. I mean, she, by name. <laughs> maybe, a little, maybe a little bit more in the future. Um, but so many services as well as every moment going out, she run up, run up to to Oshan, the store up the road sometimes, if she had half an hour to spare, grab somebody with her to go up, run down to the village, go here and there, just do a book here, a book there, a book here, a book there. And with 393 books of various kinds, Priyarani Devi Dasi! We call her the, the, the Nepali tiger. She <laughs> like a tiger on Sankatan. Jumps on people. Big man. Yeah. <laughs> when she goes, she won't say we didn't ask her to say something, but I watch her sometimes. She, you know, she, she sees somebody who looks like a potential, like 30 meters away, and there's all these people walking like this in the she, she just goes straight, blink her eyes, boom, the face of that person. Oh, people all along the line are going, oh, oh. <laughs> like a rocket she goes towards that person. Not seeing all these people falling over and bags and everything else. Like that. She says she's going to try to be a little bit more conscious and learn to look before she runs. <laughs> Free running, you like to say something? <laughs> Nothing? Come on, say something. Huh? Inspire your inspiration that I give them my yeah, if there is one, give them the mic. Just a second. Even they can't hear what they're saying themselves. Maraj, mice is here. Mice, where's mice? Hey, well done. Just give us a second, Maraj. We'll just switch. We'll give you a second, second. One second, you've already had a second. No, you've already had a second. Give me a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Make the sound louder. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Her one problem is she doesn't eat and sleep enough. Mm. She doesn't sleep and eat very much. Uh, I don't know. It's something she has to take into account. Do a little bit more. Of the needs of the body, I think. And now we're coming into the Final rundown and first marathon here in France. And very exciting. Priya Rani. She doesn't want to speak. She said and she said. She's too she's tiger, she's very shy. And tigers are very shy. She's Huh? Oh, she got the mic. actually wants me to share a story which happened in the, in the temple. There were a couple, Indian couple who came to visit for the first time uh, Radha Tadisi Swa Temple and I showed them Mahabharata and they, they were very, very happy to receive uh, the Mahabharata. Yes, I saw her doing that, so I said, yes, she did it. I saw you like to tell Radha, she, she gets quite <laughs> 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 
Well, she'll be doing something or see someone coming, she'll just <laughs> beat a 180 degrees turn, zoom, <laughs> on the spot. <laughs> yeah, wonderful. So with 201 books of various kinds and three Srimad Bhagavatam sets, God knows how she did three Bhagavatam sets, with three Srimad Bhagavatam sets, a wonderful first marathon, the first of many, we hope, here in France, in New Mayapur, or in Paris most of the time. Mahadevi Devi Dasi! She's in the kitchen! <laughs> wow, wonderful. Hare Krishna, Krishna, Thank you. And again, another astonishing, astonishing, uh, considering they're away for a marriage for two weeks, and working every day otherwise going out in their spare time and in Mauritius they got permission from the temple before they went to distribute books sometimes in Mauritius and if that score could go to France the present was very enthusiastic so no problems whatsoever um, with 440 books in total Bhakti Yumi and she even she not only beat her quota but she beat last year's score and she had a lot more time on her hands she loves to distribute books and she likes doing Arabic books as well, as you can see. Maharaj. So we have a few pictures. There is our Gopaswami Prabhu. I don't know where your wife's not there, but you're there. Gopaswami Prabhu was there with um, uh, Gayanidhi Prabhu and that's Vrindarani. Vrindarani and some other devotee. I don't know who it is. Another devotee on their book table in reunion, it looks like. It looks warmer than Paris, I can't believe it. It looks warmer than Paris. My goodness. It's bright, huh? Is that your wife? Is it? it looks like a young lady. I thought it was a young girl. Are you sure? Really? It's not a very good picture. I mean, I don't mean... I mean, from the point of view of the actual quality of the picture, it's not very sharp. Huh? Leeches? They have leeches down there? The things that suck your blood? The blood suckers down there. Hare Krishna, I think you mean that the fruit. Lychee. Lychee. Leeches are these blood suckers. <laughs> Do you mean the lychees? The lychees in French is called lychees. English is lychees. <laughs> That's slightly different. <laughs> it looks real fun, you know. I mean, it does. I mean, it's like sunny and sunny and funny. It's sunny and funny. And Paris is rainy and pain. <laughs> and rainy. Not today. Oh, glorious to all those devotees who are distant in Prabhupada's books wherever they are. And I didn't know what to put there, I just put light in the darkness. That's I thought that was, uh, what would you say, a kind of um, graphically representing what the situation is. It's a typical situation in Paris. Yeah. <laughs> Especially in Gardenoy, the other city in Gardenoy. There's so many people. Misery is less painful than? In the sun. In the sun. Yeah. Well, there wasn't much sun during this month. <laughs> maybe in reunion, maybe. Yeah, maybe in reunion. This is in Paris. You know, she, I don't know who gave her the book, how she got the book, but she's got the bag of ideas in her hand. Yeah. And she's looking at it. Well, he's looking at it. It's a woman, I think. It's a lady, I'm not sure. Yeah. 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 Anyway, that's the situation of many people. And there we are, the holy place of Sarasal San Bridgestone. Thousands of devotees have been through, through here. Thousands of books have been sold here. Thousands of kirtans have taken place. This is one. Some another Christian said it's done. There's so many books distributed there. Every day the books are doing books on the station, not just on the train. And so many nice people taking books. 
And on the train to Sarsal, there's Air Chakradar, <laughs> one of the oldest distributors we will accept that. Selling a Gita and other books to a lucky soul. He talked to him about karma, the guy got really worried. <laughs> and he started explaining, you better read this book quick. <laughs> he was very keen to take the book. He took three or four books, actually. <laughs> Quite a character. He sort of speaks a bit of English, a bit of French, a bit of Hindi. Gets away with it, so I can't understand. Well, on the one end of the four words. Somehow, no, he's so convinced that he's able to convince people with his picture of languages. <laughs> <laughs> Well, but said, I mean, look how happy they are. Our business is to be happy and make others happy, truly happy. And the one on the right was supposed to be preaching to the long arm of the law. <laughs> and there's a story there, Lila. What's the story? Oh, yeah, um, well, there were lots of people like this. My. This police officer, he came within a group of others and he was smiling, so I, I just looked at him, stopped him and asked him, like, uh, is he reading a book? And he said, like, yes. And I said, like, he's shining, like, has to be spiritual. And he was like, yes, I'm doing some yoga. Mm -hmm. And it turned out that uh, he was, like, recently in some yoga retreat wearing dhoti and stuff, so <laughs> it was, like, amazing. So I gave him the book and uh, he was very happy. So that was, like, it was very easy, actually, this one. You, you said he was wearing a dhoti at yeah, the yoga Yeah, yeah, on this uh, yoga retreat. A few retreat. weeks earlier, he, was, he himself was wearing a dhoti. Honey, <laughs> oh, <laughs> And now he's, Krishna has given him the Bhagavad Gita. <laughs> Not sure where it was, but some yoga retreat somewhere. Oh, and there he is! Whoa! Oh. Oh. Took a week break on the street. Ah, yes. There's a real shelter on the street. Huh? Oh. And temple is the street. Well, now we'll go on to that later on. And here is our Mahadevi, enthusiastically <laughs> distributing books in here and there around <laughs> Chatelet, Pompidou, and different places. <laughs> <laughs> he looks pretty serious to go out of that, doesn't he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and they both look pretty serious in some ways. And there's Yumi in action, in the train. And with one of the Westfield, I think it's Westfield, security guards. Yeah. Yeah. Yumi's not here to tell the story. Does anyone know the story? I took, well, the, I took the picture, it was during the Adinam, and uh, it was in front of... Uh, so I took this picture, it was during the Adina, and uh, it was just in front of the, donuts. the donuts shop. <laughs> and Everything took place in front of the donuts <laughs> shop. <laughs> Actually, the devotee of Yoga League said me that he, this guard, yeah. he was interesting, he yeah. asked many questions to the devotee. It's yeah. not the first time. Okay. And Yumi just uh, dropped the bomb in the <laughs> <laughs> Dropped the bomb in his hand. Yeah, very lucky, lucky guy. Uh, one anecdote about uh, just Yumi, because when she came back from Mauritius, she was very sick. Oh. And, uh, I mean, she was quite sick. And uh, so we asked her, but come on, Yumi, you were in holiday. Why are you coming and exhausted? And she told us, actually, I bought too many books from the temple to distribute. So every day I was going three hours uh, in the streets of Mauritius to distribute all the books. And, <laughs> wow. and so, yeah. So well, she went there for her, her sister's marriage or something, because she spent most of the time on Santa Claus. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> She's so enthusiastic. She's incredibly, such an enthusiastic distributor. And this is the res one of the results of her preaching in Mauritius. At the end, anyway, some shopping mall or what, I don't know. But these three ladies have all got books from her. That's right. They look like they're working in the mall. Airport, I think. Is it the airport? It could be, I mean, anything is possible. It looks funny for the airport, but you know, maybe funny things in airports nowadays. <laughs>
And then we go to the top ten. Yes, sure it's top ten book. In number ten spot. And we weren't thinking we were going to do anything, actually. It took about three weeks. 